hello my darling grade ones and whoever else is watching your moms your dads your older brothers and sisters your aunties and uncles enjoy the lesson i want to reintroduce the puppet family a little bit of ventriloquist fun today remember ventriloquist doesn't move their mouth they go hello everybody hello how are you today <laughs> okay takes a bit of practice and of course we're going to add a very very silly song just to make you smile oh. hello have you got blabbles for me Alma what are you doing here <gasps> Alma's supposed to be on Sesame Street <gasps> Alma you're not supposed to be here and it's not blabbles it's bubbles Elmo loves blowing bubbles. He likes eating bubbles. Now, while he's here with us, I'm going to remind you that he is a, can you remember? He is a Muppet puppet. And the Muppets were designed by Jim Henson, a very famous puppet maker and creator. The nice thing about Elmo is that he's got really big hands, but they are like gloves. So you can actually put your hand inside his hand and suddenly he comes to life. <laughs> I hope you haven't got fleas, Elmo. No, I want bubbles. Oh, I'm going to have to go and get him some bubbles. Wait, give me a moment. I'll be back. Some puppets are glove puppets, like our mouse librarian. Looking very smart today in his jersey and his smart pants. <laughs> squeak, squeak. A glove puppet is like a glove. Yes, he's almost like just the hand of Elmo, except he has a head. <laughs> and you can put your fingers in his head or in his hands. His mouth cannot move, so he's quite a simple puppet. Yes, but you can still get a lot of expression. Mm, you can, right? He can sniff the air. He can look sad. He can look happy. A great, great puppet to work with if you're a beginner. Okay, so remember we've got Muppet puppets and basic glove puppets. Right, I'll be back with another one now. Then you get sock style puppets. They cover your whole arm or they could be made with a short sock. The nice thing about this puppet is that they've added the little squeaky bit in the tongue. So when you close squeaky, the space um, worm's mouth, he squeaks, right? And also quite a Muppet style mouth, but still more of a sock puppet. Remember, you can make your own puppet out of a sock. Yes! Now it's time for a bit of ventriloquism. Are you ready? I've brought Bobby in. Bobby, look, it's the children. Watch my mouth now, okay? I'm just going to keep smiling, okay? Now look at Bobby, okay? Hey, guys! It's really cool to see you all! Did you see that? It really looked like Bobby was talking. The nice thing about this is you can go back and look at the video clip again. So I want you to try that today, grade ones. You're going to try and close your mouth, then smile. And go, hey guys. Hey guys. Try it. That sounds amazing. Now go, hey guys. It's great to see you. Hey guys. It's great to see you. Yay! You guys are awesome ventriloquists. It's time for a silly song. The mouse librarian has asked, Can we please sing the mouse song? Do you remember it? Now, in it you've got to go, Okay, clap, snap. Try snapping your fingers. Can you do that? Let your moms help you or your dads can help. 
So it goes like this. We are little mice, clap, snap. You got it? We are little mice, clap, snap. And we need some cheese, clap, snap. And we need some cheese. Right? It starts off soft. And in Italian, we say piano. Piano is not just a piano that you play. It also means soft. And then we're going to sing in very loud voices, almost talking voices. And when we say loud in Italian, we say forte, forte, or fortissimo, very loud. All right, let's see. Are you ready? Where's that little mouse? We are little mice, clap, snap. We are little mice, clap, snap. And we need some cheese, clap, snap. And we need some cheese, clap, snap. It goes, uh, you can have some cheese if you just say please again. We are little mice, clap, snap. We are little mice, clap, snap. And we need some cheese, clap, snap. And we need some cheese, clap, snap. You can have some cheese if you just say please. Well done. The mouse librarian is thrilled. He loves your singing. Right, Mr. Mouse Librarian. You know what he just said? He said, thank you so much. Be awesome. Remember to practice being a ventriloquist. Remember the puppet family and sing the mouse song. Love you all. Mwah.